Hello there folks and welcome to Chris Hall Motorcycles in sunny Doncaster. How are you all doing today guys? So what have I got for you today? Well it's the 2017 Indian Scout and you, if, you've, if you're an OG subscriber and you've seen the videos before you'll know that I think this is one of the best looking colour combinations of uh, a lot of motorcycles on the market today. I really do love this deep red with the tan i just think it looks absolutely fantastic um i really do yeah we've done a few of these now and every time i get one in i just think it sits really really well we've got the big brother of this in stock in the same colorway the roadmaster but anyway back to this bike in question it's like it's a 2017 it's a one owner bike from new it's only done 11,241 miles as well last serviced 150 mile ago i think he's got three or four stamps in the book the last service was fairly substantial we'll get to that in a minute um it's got some nice extras and without further ado as always let's get round the bike well and as always let's start at the back of the bike we've got this gorgeous uh tan rear backrest chrome uh rear rack as well all indian not uh patent stuff or anything like that genuine product um looking very nice at the back of the bike there standard exhaust fitted to this no scratches no scuffs or anything like that to be made aware of nice and clean this rear tire plenty of life left on that in fact the previous owner had it mot i think in august um so obviously we will supply it with a fresh mot i'll get into that more later on in the video uh, as you can see the paint on this is faultless it's absolutely gorgeous uh, we've got these beautiful leather panniers uh, again, an Indian product. I like the fake clasps just to make life easy for us in this day and age. Um, but yeah, really nice looking panniers going on there. Uh, the seats are in very good condition. There's a slight scuff just there, but only a, just a, like a leather scuff. Um, more aging and patina than the scuffing. But I'm just trying to point everything out to you guys. Working his way forward on the bike everything looks as it should be there's no dents no scratches anywhere on the engine casings or anything like that the exhausts are beautiful and again nice and clean we've got a bit of a, a mark just on the top of the exhaust just there obviously the pillion has had his boot her him her boot whatever just there and just cut cut some of the rubber on the top exhaust just there and they all do that that's a common mark but uh, again nothing to worry about at all the tank, very nice condition, and again, looking fantastic with his nice Indian logo here on the side in the black with the, with the almost gold uh, stencils, absolutely beautiful. So as we come forward, uh, we've got a touring screen fitted to this bike as well. And uh, the front mudguard, and I nearly said fender, I'd nearly said fender, folks. Uh, again, really nice and clean, and that has to be one of the neatest um fender extenders i've seen never seen one of them before um yeah that is fantastic that's really nice nice and neat that again front wheel nice and clean and front tire loads of life left in that folks so as we work our way around to this side of the bike pretty much as as a lot of cases mirror image of the other side of the bike in condition nice and clean as you can see this paint just pops it's just got real nice depth to it um, I nearly said chain and sprockets then folks, but obviously it's belt drive, it looks in good condition, it's only done 11,000 miles, there's a small bit of flake just there on the engine casing, don't know if you can make that out guys, okay, again I'm just trying to be transparent with you, point out anything that you might need to be aware of when purchasing a bike from ourselves, um, everything else looks nice and clean and as it should be, the mirrors are nice chrome, they're not tarnished or anything like that. We'll have a start up in a second, so just bear with me on that one. So, um, data tag certificate, owner's manual and service book, some invoices for some of the servicing done. Last service was a £650 service, full service fork seals, what else was done on there? Uh, oh, front brake pads, so that was all 150 miles ago. So, plenty of servicing going on there, and like I say, it's had a decent recent service as well okay so without further ado let's um let's put some life in this girl where are we where's the key just over here somewhere there we go 
finding it blind. Um, and yeah, let's uh, hit, hit the button. Here we go, guys. Just sounds really nice. It's got a nice nose note to it. I'll turn that off. But yeah, it sounds exactly like it should do. The microphone never picks up the sound of these bikes correctly as it should do. They always sound a bit tinny and stuff, but it's got a nice depth to that noise there as well. So like I say, it's a one owner bike from new, just over 11,000 miles. Last serviced 150 miles ago with a decent service as well. You know, fork seals, brake pads, uh, all the oils, etc., etc. So well looked after. So the bike will come with a full MOT. It will come with a three month warranty with ourselves and it will also go through the workshop for a che full check over prior to coming out to make sure everything is as it should be. Such a good bike these, we very popular at the moment as well, very very popular are these. Um, we can offer zero deposit finance, I can offer nationwide or international delivery and I can also offer, we can do take part exchanges as well. So if you want to know how much this bike is, there's a description below which contains the price and a link to our website where you'll find a load of photos of this bike in high definition. You can zoom in, have a closer look yourself. Uh, if there's any area I've missed, please let me know. I'll uh, WhatsApp you some photos down of any particular area you want to see. Such a good looking bike that. Like I say, we've got the Roadmaster, the big brother, in the same colourway, just, uh, just parked up here. So uh, I might do a video of the two of them together at some point. But yeah, uh, lovely Indian Scout in stock today. Don't forget, folks. Um, oh, I've almost missed out how to contact me. If you want to contact me by phone, it's 01302 760 967. Or you can email me, chrisallmotorcycles at googlemail.com. Alternatively, if you want to come down and have a look at the bike, always welcome. Kettle's usually on. If you're traveling, as always, give me a call before you set off just to make sure the bike is in stock and available. Other than that, guys, I'm going to sign off. Don't forget, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, tick that bell for notification, as always. And, um, yeah, uh, I really do appreciate the support, guys, more than you'll ever know. Like I say, the kettle's usually on. Pop in for a coffee or it's that time of year where we've got the hot chocolates flowing. Um, come and tell us you've seen us on YouTube. I'll get them in. Other than that, folks, have a fantastic day. And until next time, thank you very much. Cheers.